Hi, clue hunters. I'm Peter Larangis, author of The Viper's Nest, the seventh book in the 39 Clues series. Now, the clue hunt has taken Amy and Dan around the world, and now they're headed to a mysterious place where they discover some shocking information about their parents' past. To give you a sneak peek of The Viper's Nest, here's a special passage I can share with you. We only want what is ours. Someone had said that during the night. Amy had heard the voice from the study just after the commotion had wakened her. Alistair's voice. Alistair hadn't set the fire, but he could have said something. He could have prevented... Amy? Alistair said. Are you all right, dear? Amy looked him in the eye. Why did you keep it from them? The fact that you'd stolen the poem? I... This is hardly the time, Alistair stammered. You could have told them, Amy said. You could have shouted, I have the poem. She was running into a fire, Uncle Alistair. I was contending with so many people, Alistair said. I could barely see straight. Eisenhower Holt had some cockamamie idea that we could use the neighbor's garden hose. Eisenhower Holt was there too, Amy said. And his wife, Mary Todd, Alistair said. Dan's face was red. How many people were there just standing around doing nothing to help them? Eisenhower. Yes, Amy saw him now in her memory of the night, a gruff man with a red face and bristles for hair. They were all in it together, united. They may not all have set the fire, but without them, it wouldn't have happened. They were killers. All of them. Well, you can read the whole book when the Viper's Nest goes on sale on February 2nd. I'll see you on the hunt.